Hello, I'm Congressman Steve Womack. Soon, both chambers of Congress will be voting on a balanced budget amendment to the Constitution. I believe this vote will be one of the most important, if not the most important vote this Congress will take. Frankly, with all the discussion of deficits and debt, credit downgrades, threats of higher taxes, and other issues impacting job creation, I consider a balanced budget amendment critical to our nation's solvency. American families and businesses are expected to live within their means. In my strongest opinion, government should be no different. As you know, I served as mayor of Rogers for 12 years. A fundamental reason why our economy and our city did so well during that time was because I demanded and our city council agreed that our city should balance its budget. No gimmicks, no hollow promises, no finessing the books, a simple concept that annual expenses would not exceed annual revenues. I believe the federal government should do the same. Problem is, previous measures like PAYGO or Graham-Rudman or the Budget Enforcement Act all gave promise to balancing the budget, but it's obvious they didn't work. The only way to ensure the U.S. government lives within its means is to put it in the Constitution. Sixteen years ago, we came within a vote of passing a balanced budget amendment and with an overwhelming majority of citizens now willing to back such a measure, it's time. This Congress and future Congresses are going to have to make some tough choices to ensure America's future, as well as giving hope and opportunity for future generations. I encourage you to join the fight for a balanced budget amendment. Let your elected representatives know how you feel. Our children and our grandchildren are counting on you.